We're in Hole Lake, Massachusetts, and we're on Middle Water Street, and we're looking at the mill number two of National Blank Book. And this mill was made because National Blank Book was so very successful, and they had to up their production even more. Now, National Blank Book um, started out in New York City by an unknown the person besides the town family, and they they actually had their father in that part of the business, James Town. And it started in 1843 in New York City, and they're making blank books. That is, ledger books, accountant books, medical books, so forth. And in 1881, one of the sons, Edward, moved the mill from New York City into Hoyoke. And they didn't start down by the canal here. They started an innovation mill of the Hoyoke Water Power Company. And then they grew enough so they can come down by the Willamette Bridge and be right at the uh, uh, edge of the Willamette Bridge for years. But they again grew so much, and they came here too. So they had two enormous mills going. And they're a very successful company, well loved by all the employees. Now sadly, the National Blank Book Mill number one is gone. There's only mill number two left. And we're looking at that right now. It's the only thing that we can ju judge by what the other mill must have looked like, except all their pictures. So here, um, they take in the second level canal's water, the very end of it, and they put it through their races or tunnels, and it goes out to connect a river that's just beyond, just like their own mill number one would have done. These front windows are still open. The side windows would have been open. Um, it's, it's a mill that was made about 1900 or so, so they also used electricity too. And they had hundreds and hundreds of employees. And it didn't finally peter out until about the 1990s when they bl they blended into uh, Avery Dennison. And then they were in Chicopee and then they moved out to Texas and then Mexico, and that's it. But it was a, quite the beloved uh, company for everyone that worked here. So thank you for coming here.